is small Z surgery. Hi, this is Ricky Lee in small Z surgery on Nova. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome. It is the gorgeous Ricky Lee. Am I in the right spot? Yep, you're perfect. You look hot. You look sexy. She looks stunning, doesn't she, everybody? <laughs> Does she look, in the right she spot. looks, she looks fantastic. I did this face at mm. 5 a.m. Well, so you look I don't, for someone who woke up I, at five. She is giving. And I and I went to bed at one because I just was so awake. You yeah. know when you're awake before something important? Yeah. And then you for just this don't interview. sleep. <laughs> for this, this, is, this, this is the one I woke up so early. <laughs> well, I mean, as I mean in the building, I mean, she hung around a little bit after her show. Thanks for that. <laughs> yes. You know, can I just say... It's far less impressive getting you on the show these days when you work literally in <laughs> the studio next through door. You the window every yeah. day. Yeah. yeah. But, but it's quite fun. I still get to excited have... to see you. It's this is cool. It's great to see you. Um, the new song, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, the video clip came out on Friday. Yeah. Wow. I know, it's ridiculous. You, I mean, you almost die. If you haven't <laughs> seen the video clip yet, it's you perched on a hill <laughs> in Queenstown. Yeah. Like, yeah. you could have fallen off a glacier. I'm gonna, I'm then gonna... what would Nova would have done? Well, you no. were our saving grace. <laughs> <laughs> but at least I would have looked fabulous. Oh, you would have died. You know, like if I if I, if I I fell down one of those glacier crevices mm. and they didn't find me for 500 years, what a sight it would what have a, been, though. Like, like I had Captain the dress, Ameri- I had the weaving, I had the good lashes on, like those big thick ones. It's like Captain America <gasps> and Marvel. And because it was ice, it would have been preserved. Yeah, perfectly, perfectly preserved. We it would have been... <laughs> Then we could have defrosted you and you would have kept singing. Yeah, I would have. You I would have been like, oh, no, no, no. Like, I totally would have. Um, um, so anyway, fun. The video clip is out and everyone needs to go check it out. Where is it? Oh, it's everywhere, right? It's everywhere. It's yeah. on YouTube. It'll be on the, the gym. It'll, yeah. be, it'll be everywhere. But also, I can't wait to pump weights at the gym and just see you just <laughs> belting out that tune. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be great. It's going to be it's, great. It's always quite awkward at the gym mm. when I don't have a face on. I'm all sweaty. And because when I exercise, my face goes real red. Yeah. Like it goes like tomato red my okay. whole face and I look like I'm about to die <laughs> okay and so sometimes I'm at the point of about to die and mm. then my music video comes on and, and then look, everyone you know, in the gym looks at you and they go like, Who's that does that? not look she like does not life. look like that <laughs> <laughs> smoke and mirrors 101 <laughs> um the song is on my own give us a 4-1 can you tell me all about it yeah yeah, I mean, I, I feel like this is, oh, it sounds so corny to say, but yeah, I feel like this is a song that I've been trying to write my whole life. Yeah. I feel like I've always kind of been a bit of an underdog. I've I've always had to be independent. My mum was a single mum when I was growing up and I I just always knew how important it was to to never have to rely on anyone okay. and to know that you can do everything by yourself yep. and to know that you have the confidence and the strength to do stuff. Mm. And I've always felt that way. And I've kind of, in my career, I've always gone against the grain and done things that aren't necessarily traditional. I yeah, said, no, tr- said no to things that people would always say yes yeah, to. And yeah. I've, I've kind of carved out my own path over the last 19 years. And I, I, I think that that all comes from growing up the way that I did and that sense of independence and self-sufficiency. And, and really that song is that's what this song is about but I keep hearing what this song means to people yeah I've had people reaching out to me that are sick that have left terrible relationships that have been single and on their own for ages or that that have been through like the craziest wildest things and the way that people interpret music is different it's yeah. different to the way that sometimes it was intended or the, the it is for the writer but yeah. it's it's amazing to actually hear that as an artist well I've seen Ricky Lee's car in the car park and she's doing quite alright on her own <laughs> let me tell you she's doing quite quite alright <laughs> um, how is the radio show going can I ask it's very how, fun how long you been doing it for now I can't even remember like well a, officially like two couple, weeks yeah, yeah. I don't know, but unofficially four days yeah un- um, but no I, I, I think I think I, the first day I came in was March of last year. Oh, okay. So uh, pretty much a year. <laughs> how is, how is, are you, it's really is fun. it easier than TV? Is it harder than TV? Tell me, uh, well, let's psychoanalyze this for you. Well, TV, are you enjoying it? TV, the days are long. Okay. Like the days, especially because I got to slap on the face. I got to mm. put in the way. That's just it's yeah. too, too many hours of having to get ready for yep. TV. Um, and then we're filming generally all day, like Australian Idol. I'll oh. get there at six and I leave at like Sounds rubbish. Sounds 11. tough. I mean, honestly, very, why would you want to? Why would you do it? Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> she did the inter- she did the no, international sign for money, no, everybody. Did she did the international <laughs> sign for money. <laughs> um, and but so th- this is really fun. Like music as well is yeah. very. It's 
all, all it's everything. You pour your everything into it. It's creative yeah. work, so it's your thinking. Ugh. Um, it's very, it's quite draining and exhausting. But this radio is fun. You, you come in, it? the boys are hilarious. Do you it's, have a favourite, Tim or Joel? No. No. Me, no. Me, you, you're me. my favourite. That's what I like you're, to hear. Hey, I've been, hey, I, even when before you were on the show, on the radio, I was playing your records and they absolutely. were and they were. No, and they absolutely. Were, no. You're my favourite. You always that's, have been. That's what I like to hear. Hey, we've got a game on this show that yeah. I call Jinx. You okay. know what Jinx is when you say the same thing yeah, at the yeah, same yeah. time? Yeah. Let's have a crack at it. Okay. Small All right, the Jinx Challenge happening and it's going to be the On My Own edition. I'm going to ask a question. Uh, they'll all be related to things you can do on your own. <laughs> uh, and then we'll have to give, if we give the same answer at the same time, hey, presto, we're winners, baby. Okay. 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 Yeah. I'll ask the first question. You'll then hear a counter. Once the counter's done, we say the answer at the same time. Okay. But are you ready to go? Yeah, I think, do I, don't, I still don't understand what's happening because I was looking at you. I was listening. Yeah. And I was nodding. But you weren't hearing. But I didn't, it didn't compute. So okay. let's see how this Name goes. something that you can do on your own. The idea here is that we say the same thing at the same time. <laughs> know what I'm Two, thinking. One. No! <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We okay. win. We I win. Got get the a point. Gist of the okay. game. Yeah, game. Okay, <laughs> Name something you can do with one other person. Something you can do with one other person. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know what I'm thinking. No, I don't Already. actually. I don't know. Have Drive a car. <laughs> okay, no, that's a. That was, it's not all sex related. I was just Damn. like, you can go for a car ride with someone uh, else. Okay, okay. okay. All right. well, we're cleaning it up. I yeah, get we, it. Yeah, clean it up. You know, we did one Do masturbating. We have to, it's not the drive show up in here. Okay. You guys oh, might not guys, have. Yeah. You, oh, you have like. Oh. You, you got to clean it up in the drive show. Okay. Night show. Yeah. We've got a bit of a, a bar. You got a, you, a standard. Yeah, yeah. I have a standard here. Okay. Name something you can do in a group. Oh no! <laughs> oh, okay. Yep. Go here on. we go. Here we go. Three, two, one. Three. Karaoke. Three. <laughs> <laughs> But karaoke, very good. You can do karaoke. I just did karaoke it? in New Zealand when we finished shooting the video. Was it great? It was so much fun. But I, I, I realised at the end of the night. Mm. Do you? Sorry, sidebar. Yeah. When you do karaoke, do you sing like you sing, or do you just scream or shout like well, normal I'm people? Well, I'm generally very drunk when I do karaoke, so I. I definitely scream. scream. <laughs> yeah, great. It's, yeah. It would be one it's, of those things like, I don't want to do karaoke with Ricky. She just sings like she can. That's, no, no, no one wants that. No, and karaoke isn't, winning karaoke isn't about being the best singer. It's about the performance mm. and the commitment and Absol the passion. Totally agree with you. Um, totally agree so, with you. So, yes, no, I, I, I don't hear. think it's very good, but we just did that and it was quite fun. Great But to I hear didn't that. share the mic with anyone. It was me and... Um, yeah, me and the, the director, who's also quite a loud mouth. Yeah. And then there were other people in the room that were a bit shy and yeah. maybe not so confident, and yeah. they didn't, unfortunately, get a chance. No, we But buried. we had a wonderful You had a great night. time. Yeah. If anyone asks, you had a great time. Yeah, I had a wonderful night. I don't know what you're talking about, um, sad sack. The new song is called On My Own. Uh, how many songs in the pipeline? What do you got? You, you, you're working on heaps, right? There's a whole album. So I've spent the last year in the studio. Mm. I think my fans have been like, you're abandoning us. Why are you doing TV and you're doing radio and you're not, there's no music. Where is the music? I've been working on the music. Yep. I moved, I moved to the US a few years ago and, and lived there to make music. And I came back and it was just, everything was shit. So I was just <laughs> not going to release it. And hey, you had some, you've had hits. Yes, but I, oh, but that's what I mean. I'm, if I write stuff and it's yep. not, I'm not oh, putting not it out just, it, just for the sake, sake of, of it. Okay, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. So this last year, I've spent the year mm. writing the album with the same people, the same people that I wrote on my own with and, yeah. and worked with on that. We've done a whole album and it's all not like, on my own is like the the entree. Okay. And then the rest of the album. Well, sign me up for the main. Yes. Sign me, up, sign me up for the main and the dessert, let oh, me tell you. So, I can't, uh, yeah. There's a whole album that's coming. It'll be out by the end of the year. I can't wait for everyone to hear the I rest can't of wait it. to play it. Ricky, always good to see you. Thanks for dropping by this show and get back to your show tomorrow <laughs> afternoon four o'clock right thank you yes see you then smallsy surgery is a nova podcast for more great shows like this head to novapodcast.com.au